Guys, this is Jonathan and Bob CNC. Welcome back to Getting Started. Today we're going to be going over the circle and the star features in Basic Cam. So to get started, let's go up here to our circle. Now the first thing we can do is we have an X center and we have a Y center. That's going to be the position on the grid that the circle is going to pop up on. Next we have our radius, which is going to be half of your diameter. So let's say I wanted a one inch circle, then I would want my radius to be 0.5 or half an inch. The next thing we have, this is your segments. Now your segments is going to be how many lines going around that circle it's going to be made up of. So if you had a really, really large circle and you didn't have a lot of segments, then it's going to look choppy and you're going to be able to see those, those angles where those lines intersect. So I'm going to go ahead and let's go ahead and cre I'll create this. As you can see, when you create this, there's just little, you can see little corners as it goes around. It's still in the, in the shape of a circle, but you can have little corners where those lines intersect. Delete. So what I want to do is I want to add more, more line segments. So let's say we add 50 line segments to that circle. And now it's much, much smoother as it goes around because it has more line segments to make up that curve. The last thing we can do with that is let's say we wanted to create like an octagon or a pentagon or something like that. It would basically be a five or a eight-sided circle. So I can create an eight-sided circle and now we have that shape. Go ahead and delete that. Now the next thing we want to talk about is our star. You still have your X and your Y center, but now we have an outside diameter and an inside diameter and we have the number of points. I'm going to go ahead and create this. Now our outside diameter is going to be the diameter of these points right here. The inside diameter is going to be the inside of these points. And then your, your number of points is going to be these. So this is the, the standard ratio for a standard five point star. Go ahead and delete that. But let's say, the wrong one. Let's say I wanted to create something with an inside diameter of 3.5 and I wanted to have 50 points. So I can create that, and now it's going to get me this. So it, this right here I can change based on your inside diameter and your outside diameter, and then how many points I want it to have it going around. And the same thing is true if I, let's say I wanted to have a, a four point star, then I can create that, and now we have this right here. So that, that's how you use the circle, that's how you use the star. If you have any questions, please feel free to drop us a line and I will see y'all later.